guys so obviously by the name already know that today I'm going to be doing my ipsy unboxing this is for the month of February and I'm so super excited because I've seen tons and tons of pictures of um, people's ipsy bags like on Instagram and stuff like that and the products look super super good I'm praying that I got the I think it's the Lux, the Luxy Luxy Beauty or Lux I have no idea it's a brush though so fingers crossed so the first thing I feel for is the ipsy card and this month is I guess like a Valentine's love thing um, it says hashtag ipsy love not really important so then I got the bag actually wait I feel something Ooh! yeah I actually did get the brush and I'm so super excited it's kind of like a a blush brush or like even I can kind of contour with this kind of bronze up my face I can use it for different things I can even use this for highlighting um, I'm so so super excited um, I did actually my mom for Valentine's Day she got me this brush right here this is the number 540 the fan brush and now I have another one that I got for 10 bucks a month and I think this brush alone is probably like eight to ten dollars so Super excited that I got this. We're already off to a really, really good start. And this is the bag of the month. This bag is actually really cute. Um, I really love the pink contrast with the... It's kind of like a grayish taupe color. It's really cute. Um, so the first thing in here is a plastic bag. I don't know. Okay, I guess this thing was supposed to come in it. This is a Rob Sheppy for Teeny Beauty. It kind of has a picture of a martini. This is a powder eyeshadow in the color Pearl Fizz. It actually looks really nice. Kind of similar to the lid shade I have on my eye. Um, this look is actually going to be up in a couple of days. Maybe like 2-3 days. Um, it's all drugstore products which is super exciting because I've never done a full face drugstore. So this is what the eyeshadow looks like. Um, it has... 0 0.06 ounces which is it's enough it's definitely enough um it's super pretty super shimmery too oh so pretty oh my god i definitely see myself using this a lot so watch out for this in future tutorials possibly then the next thing i have here is the hey honey take it off exfoliating honey peel off mask for all skin types this is awesome I love peel off masks there's something about like pulling a mask off your face that is really enjoyable for me so and it does say I mean it says hey honey take it off so I don't know if I can use this with a full face of makeup probably not just to be safe but yeah it's an exfoliating honey peel off mask sounds really really awesome can't wait to try this I'll probably try it on tonight when I take off my makeup ooh okay and then the next thing I got in the bag is a cargo cosmetics lip gloss and this is in this is in Anguilla or Anguilla I don't I don't really know but it's a really nice like baby pink I don't really wear colors like this but I guess we'll see how it looks okay I can't open it um the packaging on this is really really cute though it's kind of like a itty bitty mini size um i'm not really sure if this is the full size or a sample size but it's really pretty it's a really nice baby pink color like i said i'm not really sure how i'm gonna like this but it looks super pretty and it's pretty opaque like it gives off a lot of color for it being a lip gloss so super excited to try this out as well. And then the last product I have is a blush. And this is from Model Co. This is not the first time we get something from Model Co. And um, I kind of have mixed feelings about their products. Because some of them are like really awesome. Um, and some of them just really suck. Like I remember a couple months back we got a mascara. Um, it kind of looked like the L'Oreal Miss Mango one. I, for I think it just had Model Co. on it and it sucked ass. Okay, that, that was inappropriate. But it really, really sucked. Um, I just didn't like it. It smelled really horrific. So, yeah, this is the blush in Cosmopolitan 01. 
and this is super bright oh my god but it's not like a really chalky brush it's actually really nice and silky I like it it kind of reminds me of my Sigma powder brush which I talk about a lot but yeah I'm so super excited. So that was it for this month's bag. I know it was kind of short, but I feel like the products in this bag are so freaking amazing this month. Like, definitely we'll get use out of the brush, definitely out of the blush, definitely of the lip gloss. I really, really want to try this exfoliant. And this eyeshadow is awesome. So this month is definitely, definitely, definitely an awesome month. Um... Yeah, I feel like Ipsy's been really upping up their game as far as, like, companies that they send to us. Um, like, Monaco is pretty frequent, but this is an awesome product. I think this is the first time I get something from Rob Sheppy. Hey Honey, I've never heard of, but it sounds really cool. Luxie and then Cargo, awesome brands. So I'm so super excited. I will be doing some videos using these products with you guys. I'm kind of thinking about doing, I don't really know if I would call it a series, but videos that I use things that I got from my Ipsy bag, like just incorporating some of the items. Um, I don't know, but let me know if you guys would like to see a video like that, like where I use some Ipsy products that I've gotten before or recently got. And yeah, you kind of want to see them like work out on my face. Anyways, thank you guys for watching so, so much as always. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.